That's right, folks. We're going to be playing Enigmities number three. I have recorded number one, number two. You'll find playlist links in the description. Check them out. Some of my all-time favorite games. And I'm super excited to be playing the third game. Hopefully you are as well. Uh, this is the Steam edition. Uh, so this is also available on Big Fish Games and on Steam. Special thanks to Artifix Monday. They actually supplied me with this copy. So why don't we get into this? I think we are ready to play. Let's play. So we have the Shadow of Karkala. And we have Casual, Advanced, Expert, and Custom. Let's do this. It's not just about stopping him. I want revenge. He took Emily from me, remember? Rick, I know. But we can't let anger cloud our judgment. That will only lead to us making mistakes. And... Rick! You need to level it out! I can't! Damn thing's stuck! You gotta do something. So this is a another, I guess, sequel, if you will. This is a uh, background story. The creature was in the first game, the second game, and it looks like we're chasing them in the third game. <laughs> wow, this looks amazing. In the second game, there was a giant raven. It was awesome. And a little girl. Remember the little red-headed girl? She was cool, too. on it. I feel like this is making it worse by breaking the window. No, no, no! Hey, are you okay? Ooh, I'm alright. What's going on? Oh, great. Now what? Damn it! Come on! What's that smell? Wait, Rick, don't! Don't start the engine until I tell you. There's a fuel leak somewhere. Hurry up! We're flying straight towards a mountain. This is like the worst flight ever. Wow. All right, let's get the fire extinguisher out. We're going to use it. Grab and hold the nozzle, move it in over the flames to finish them. Yeah! I love doing this. I like being a fireman. How's that fire? fire? We're amazing. Talk to Rick. I love the sound of the wind coming through here. Hey, Rick. Fuel pumps are dead. We won't make it without both engines. Uh, sure. Seal the fuel leak. Wow, listen to that wind. We have to find everything. A plus symbol on the item indicates that you can inspect it closer and interact with it. Oh no, we need batteries. It's empty, but maybe I'll find another use. Why am I still able to see this? Just banging it. It's a Mundi Cantus. What? Is that like a Sony Walkman? Got me some batteries, so our flashlight will now operate. I think this is like one of those headlamps. Stick on your head. Now, oh, what am I doing? Supposed to be doing anything here. Oh, it's a collectible, I think. We have to find all 15 feathers. Alright, folks, if you do spot any of those feathers, please shout it out. If I don't get it uh, in the next episode, then maybe somebody else will get it as they're watching along here. Use a hint if you get stuck. I'm not really stuck, but 
sure. The fuel pipes are damaged. I need to fix them. I've got tape. Oh. Maybe that's not what we need to do. We need a new replacement hose. A hose nose. I love how this is all animated. It's so neat. Let me go back this way. Oh, still got the flashlight on, too. We need to fix those pipes, or this is going to be a real short flight! Actually, it feels kind of long. <laughs> I thought we would have hit the mountain by now. Uh, hey, where else can I go here? Or maybe I can cut the hose off here. Aha. Oh, we didn't keep the knife? All right. Let's tape it up. A little duct tape. Try it now! Brick, tell me we're not going to crash. Blasted stupid thing! Remember Maple Creek? Uh, we are this close to finding him! Uh, Four days earlier. I'm a private investigator. For the past few years, I've been hunting a serial murderer named the Preacher. Now I'm searching for any clue as to where he might have disappeared to. I came back to where it all began. What? We're going back to me. The Maple only Creek. problem is. Rick, I already checked the place top to bottom three times. Has to be a clue about where he's headed. Oh, jeez. Uh, call you later. Might have a lead. <laughs> uh, might have to peel me off the ceiling. Spot all stains of evil, the shadowy echoes of corrupted souls and their foul deeds. That's kind of neat. Uh, what's this bobblehead here? <gasps> it's like a mystery case files bobblehead. Madam Fate. Ooh, hard to fix some of the keychain here. We open up here. We have a map. Thank you very much, map. I like how it's a touristy map. This is great. Okay, put that away. The map allows for fast travel between locations except blocked ones that you know that you've not visited. Got myself a revolver. Uh, what's this here? Case file, the preacher. Homicide, multiple at large. Murder weapon. Oh, yes. All oh, those innocent people dead because of him. That's right, folks. So you have to. Sh I should say have to. You should check out the first two series. Uh, like I said, I've got both of them recorded. There's some old school stuff there, so you'll kind of see that some of those videos are. Well, I mean, they're. They're old. <laughs> They're uh, from when I first started on YouTube, so you might want to check them out just for that reason alone. We've got some bullets for our gun. Some ammos. The radio needs to be adjusted. Let's play some tunes. I think we're ready to get outside. I want to go look through my tasks here. So we got to learn about the creatures whereabouts. I like the music here. This makes me think of Highland music. Not ready for that yet. Oh, hello. What we got here. People abandoned Maple Creek after the brutal tragedy. I'm coming for you, preacher. Say a prayer for yourself. Well, the vengeance is strong. Hmm. Let's go here. Take some of those. Maybe we can shoot this. Ha ha ha! That was awesome. I love it. Just wasted a bullet, but totally worth it. Whoa, find all the Widow's Sorrow flowers. So we have three collectibles. We have flowers. We have those spirits, I guess. 
spirit smudges or whatever it was, and feathers. Keep your eyes peeled for all those. Burn in hell, a preacher. Guess we can't get in there. I've already looked inside, but I didn't find anything. What about here at the bell? There's something down there. How did I miss it? Good question. How did you miss it? It's oh, it's way too heavy for us to lift it. Hmm. Was someone trying to drag it out? What's this all about? Oh no! Corkscrew. What is this all about? Oh, it's our digital evidence board. So that's one thing that this series is known for, is these evidence boards that you have to kind of manipulate the clues to build a story. It's very much like the Nine Clues as well, if you've uh, played those. If you haven't, you might want to check those out too. Select the preacher and take a closer look. The most dangerous man I've ever met. He just looks super creepy. Azamodia, uh, walking the world again. I won't let it happen. Okay, so I've got some hedge clippers. Jeez, Louise. Woo! Hoo -hoo -hoo. Two jump scares in like 11 minutes. Man, oh man. The music is just so soothing, but unsettling at the same time, you know what I mean? All the instructions to finish the main oh mini game. Place the rugs in the proper sockets to climb the pole. Stuck? You can skip. I am not ready to get. Okay. Dragging, please. We are gonna climb our way to freedom. What the heck is that? Got a faster than light achievement. I have to get rid of the ceramic can if I want to detach the cable. I guess we'll just pull out our load again then. Oh yeah, it's action-y. What? <laughs> a good thing we've got unlimited ammo. Imagine if that was it, like you had no more ammo and it was like a survival horror game now. You have to find ammo somewhere. Okay, let's get this bell out of here. It's the bell. Go here, turn the car on. Let's do this. Nicely done. we we'll take those keys. We have cleared a pathway. Get these old wooden planks here. Off. What the heck is this thing? Ah. Put the token Long on ago, there. a great battle was fought between the demon Asmodai and the Archangel Raphael. The Archangel Raphael? Oh, that's intriguing. Raphael slew Asmodai and cast him into oblivion. His followers, the Reapers, scattered. Millennia passed, and the demon's calls somehow breached our world. The Reapers rejoiced. Okay, we need to do this. Asmodai ordered his adherents to slay each other using the special ceremonial dagger he had given them. That's right, so we're gonna do a little bit of a history lesson here from the previous games. So let me think about this for a second. Only the dagger could end their immortal lives. Mm-hmm. All the stabbiness, and then it left only one, and that was the preacher. 
With each passing century, fewer and fewer of Asmodai's reapers walked the earth. All the vicious stabbies. Oh, looks like I messed up here. Should have went here first. Oh well. At first, there were 12. Today, there remains only one. Come on. Oh, maybe I can go back and do this again. Oh, that's kind of cool. Awesome. I'm so glad I didn't have to restart the puzzle. That is such a nice way to do that. I am quite happy with that, actually. You could retrace your steps and just fix an error instead of having to start all over again. Nice. I like it. The last reaper is meant to be the one who resurrects the demon and becomes his unholy vessel. And that one is the preacher. I just love how that one puzzle just gave us just enough exposition or story for us to kind of get a sense of where we have been in the last two games. Pretty cool. Okay, so what do we got here? We're out of the atmospheric noises here. Look at the little rain droplets. I mean, it's just like it's water seeping through here. This is cool. This is just more of why I love the RTS mini games. They're just so well crafted. Yeah, we're gonna have to light that up. Light it up, up, up. Just light up every single candle. Sure, why not? We now have a sticky wax in our back pocket. Only the last and strongest of the Reapers will the demon deem worthy enough to be his host. A week ago, the Preacher killed the last of his fellow Reapers, meaning he's the only one left. So yes, the Raven was from the second game. The main character in the second game. Preacher was kind of like the main character in the first game. And he shows up during the second game. I mean, I don't want to call these spoilers, but it's telling us, so <laughs> just give me a little bit of further explanation. There's our collectible. It's good to know. So we need to put that there. It looks like we're going to need maybe one or two more. Look at that. The, the burning candles look really well made. Neat. There's another ring. These maps might prove useful, but I don't have the tools to analyze them. I also wouldn't know where to start. Elena. Cool. Back to that. Another snapshot with our cell phone. Sickle, hunting horn, parchment, apple, bone, fish, leaf, ship, saber, chalice, steering wheel, snake. It sounds like a list for a hope scene here. Oh no, it's all busted. The cursed tool of ritual murder. It's in the preacher's hands again. Over here. This is a square and it's missing. We can just use the wax here. Maybe, maybe not. this back here, I suppose. So how am I supposed to get this working again? Oh, I see. We gotta put them together. Then we wax them up. Wax on, wax off. <laughs> what am I referencing when I say wax on, wax off? Go ahead and let me know in the comments if you know what I'm talking about. Okay, so this looks like it's gonna be a battle between Raphael, Archangel, yep, definitely looks like it, that's the square we needed, let's go over here and shove that right there, 